what is going on guys we're back with another video of the fishing dream i hope y'all are having an amazing day out there i just realized about five minutes ago that i did not do an intro for this video if y'all wondering by the title and the thumbnail of the video yes yes i'm back with another catch cook on the channel it's been a while since i've done one a few of you guys have been requesting over and over in the comment section but yes we're finally getting to one right now me mark and adrian and maybe even pedro he might meet up with us at the end are getting together to do a little bit of a fish taco catch and cook thing we're gonna hopefully catch a couple of bluegill crappy just to see whatever that will bite we might keep a bass it was under one pound one and a half pounds not nothing too big we want to we want to get some amounts of meat for tacos we're gonna scoot along over to adrian's house um get to the pond creek wherever we're gonna be fishing we're not sure right now but we're gonna get on over there right now and you guys are in for a good video stay tuned like subscribe turn on that notification bell for all updates and uh let's get on over to do some fishing I was here the other day, it was moving. Don't get tangled. No, no. Dang it. Okay. Really? Yeah, okay. All right. So that's pretty cool. First cast, little bluegill. So yeah, there's so many fish in here. Oh, I just saw someone swipe at it. Oh, here we go, yeah. Uh-huh. That's, that's a lot bigger. Deep fry the entire fish. All right. We have both sides to fish. That's a big hook mark. Fish. Too small or Oh this might that that'll keep. That will definitely keep. That will definitely keep right there. Alrighty guys, so after I don't know about 15 minutes after fishing this little creek, we decided to head on over to a little pond where there were bass, pickerel, catfish, pretty much a lot of species that we could keep for the video so the creek wasn't it so we chose to go to this little pond here you guys will see us fish here for a little bit again i don't want to make this super long because the actual preparing of the fish and cleaning and catching and all that other type of stuff takes a while so let's go do some more fishing and i'll see you guys our next catch so, so we've made it to our second spot here we're at a little pond um roadside and we're just gonna see what we can do with a little Bubba Tail Junior Grub. Let's see if there's any gills around here that are hungry. This sucks. You go to the ocean to fish. Oh, stud bass, stud bass. Mark, mark, mark. Mark, keep him, get him, get him. Let's go. Oh my God, yeah. And this is just like perfectly under two pounds. Freaking go. I like closer. Oh, dude, this is not a bad bass. Where are you That's from? not bad. Where would you say you're actually, that's nice actually. This is that's perfect. actually not a bad bass at all. That's like one and a half. I'm only keeping the eyes though, right? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. only no, keeping the eyes, dude. It's so hot. I feel so gross right now. Just eat it. Satisfies all nine valves and taste buds. 
that's a 10. Alrighty fellas, so I think we have the fish for the catch and cook. This thing isn't too big, it isn't too small. I think it's just about a pound. Fine, there's tons of bass in here. Nothing to be worried about. I know you guys keep saying, it hey, don't keep bass, don't keep bass, it's not good. I'm like, dude, there's so many bass in here. This thing's probably been caught too many times. But yeah, there we go, a little one pound bass right there, one and a half. Um, I guess we'll go knock them out, put them in the cooler, and uh, I, guess the, I guess the popper did some good work. I got it on video too, so that was pretty cool. Let's go catch some more. The guy oh, Adrian, Adrian, fish. Like a... You got it, you got it. Bring it up, bring it up. Oh, that's a big one. Oh, oh yeah. that that will actually <laughs> keep. Bam. Oh, bam. <laughs> I'm gonna get back in the water. <laughs> no, that thing will keep. Oh, that's God. big. Ew, this keep it. Up. Oh, Mark, he's got a stud. He's got a five pound bass. Keep it or nah? Oh, he swallowed it. You mean a five inch fugo? Don't he do swallowed that it. Green sun, is that a green sun fish? No, what the heck is up with its mouth? You can kick that thing out of retirement, dude. No. You swallowed the hook anyways. Oh my god, wait, what? Yeah, there's something wrong with its mouth. What the heck? That's been wait, caught before. What happened? Let me see. See its mouth? It's been it's caught before. <laughs> the long jaw. Oh, dude. That, uh, oh, I don't want that. Don't keep no, 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 no. Somebody caught him and ripped his mouth. That's yeah, the problem. That. All right, so we're about to leave the pond now. We got the fish. We have five bluegill oh, and about a one pound bass. What? It's right. I just saw it right over there. We're going to head on over to Adrian's house and cook the fish up. First of all, flay them. Let's go. Let's go catch them. Yerd. Let's go cook some fish up. Pete Pedro's new hairstyle right there. Yes, sir. Alrighty. Bluegills. And it's very expensive. And the bass. Bass. I'm gonna do the bass first, I think. Alrighty, fellas. So here we go with the bass. We're gonna do the normal flaying technique. Just get down in there. This isn't the best knife, but you know, it'll do. Yeah, all right. You just want to feel it. I know it's kind of an odd angle. I'm trying my best though. Run the knife down through it. And once, you, once you're done, you can just go on the other side, poke through. Just like that. But for today, we got this buddy. One side, and now we just gotta poke it through over here. Oh, okay, so this is, dude. Do you see how much meat? Mm. Mm. Thick. Dude, this is actually like, Whoa. very good. Now there's a couple <laughs> of tin bones down here. We just gotta cut out. This out right here. But this is the one filet we got. Not bad at all. Kind of mangled it right there, but nice. Now, yeah, Pedro. So Mark's filling the bluegills right now. I, what did I just do? <laughs> no, 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 no. And you got to get lower than that. Get around the thin and everything. All right, so. Oh, I just saw right the rim. Kill it <laughs> He's working on the bluegills. We're waiting on Adrian to get all the spices and everything out for the tacos. I'll see you guys in a few seconds. First is eggs, right? No, first, first, first is, flour. is flour. Then eggs, then bread Flour, crumbs. eggs, bread then bread crumbs, yes. Mm -hmm. So these are all the fillets. I'd say about a pound or so of meat right there. Not bad. So what do we do? We just dunk it in the flour, corn starch, whatever that is. Yes, sir. Need some golden crispies here. Looks good. Now the flour. Oh, yeah. Make sure everything is covered. Alrighty. So we have the fish tacos all wrapped up here. The burrito, um, not burrito. Um, is that my water that you got for me? Yeah. But yeah, this is it. You drank it. You drank it. Got some corn to go it. with it. I think you drank Let's it. See. No, this is mine. So then who drank it? Nick, did you drink both of those waters? <laughs> no. Yeah, you did. <laughs> so eat this corn. It's so good. Aight, it's aight. Who's gonna have this fish? You can have it. I'd give it a 
six out of ten. It doesn't have salt to it. That's the problem. I mean, it doesn't eat it. It could go with it. You put salt in it? Where does it go with the bread? There's salt in it. Yes. Oh. You don't have good taste. I really don't have good taste. Not bad. Alrighty, fellas, I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's Catch and Cook. If y'all want to see me do more Catch and Cooks on the channel, go comment below all of your video opinions, all of your video suggestions, and even, even some video ideas. Let me know in the comments. I seriously take them to notice, okay? But if you guys enjoyed watching, please leave a like, subscribe, comment. I really have nothing else to be said. Hopefully, we'll get to some smallmouth fishing in rivers, creeks, even some trout fishing in this fall time. I know a few of you guys want me to do some of that, too. Maybe we'll even do some cat fishing. I'm not sure, guys. Let me know what you guys want to see in the near future. That's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching, and I'll see you guys next time on The Fishing Dream. Keep fishing. Have a good day.